Good morning, good morgen. We have travelled down to the southwest tip of Germany and we are here to do Dry Landergarten Park Run. It's a small event, 20 to 30 runners every week, and it's a stunningly gorgeous morning, hot already. Um, but yeah, we're super excited. This park run is about three kilometres from our friend's house. So it's their local park run. They've never done it and they do do a bit of running. So I'm hoping this might be the start of something beautiful and maybe they'll start coming every week. But uh, yeah, really excited to be here for a new park run and I think only our second park run we've ever done in Germany. We've parked just up here. There's parking left and right. The cafe is just up here. We'll go and find out about that after park run. And then we're just entering the park. And actually, that's really beautiful. And I can see some park runners. And park run being set up. I'm just getting really excited by the German signs. <laughs> It will be signposted and marshalled, but we're just having a little. Um, there's the yellow arrows that you yeah. know all, all the A little way look at the map. Yes. <laughs> just collecting before park run. Um, they don't usually have this many visitors, so they don't normally do like a first timers welcome. So just doing sort of ad hoc, um, individualised welcome, which feels really lovely actually. So we've had a look at the map. Two figures of eight. But the middle of the figure of eight does come up the finish funnel, so we've been warned, don't come into the finish after one and a half loops. <laughs> so carry on, do the small loop, then come up again, and then you can go into the finish funnel. Um, I'll put a map here. This park run is super close. Oh, in fact, have I even said where it is? Yes, I think I have at the start of the video. Dry Landergarten Park Run. So it's the park of three countries. We are very, 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 very close to the Swiss border and I've just been chatting to some park runners. They live in Basel. So they've just come over this morning. Um, so yeah, France, Germany and Switzerland. Park Run France is currently paused due to insurance issues. So um, any French park runners living in the area, they could come over. Um, and then there's a park run. Freiburg is the nearest in Germany. So yeah, just chatting to everyone, really trying to get our friends embedded in the community so that they come back. Most people are visitors though so far, so we need to go and try and meet a few more Germans, a few more locals. We're walking up to the start at the moment. So this will be our start to finish straight. Welcome to Dryland Gardens, this is our 81st park run. Um, a beautiful morning. Those of you who are new to today, I think you've all had the route explained. It's very straightforward. Follow the signs. Just remember it's two laps, two figures of eight, okay? Um, visitors, just a quick shout out. We've got, we've, we've got Dublin. Oh, Dublin. Yay! <laughs> This is a gorgeous place to run and the run director was saying maybe we'll set an attendance record. I didn't actually look what the record was. I know they've had sort of six or seven park runners some weeks and um, sort of 30 odd other weeks. But no, I didn't look. So it'd be exciting to see if we do set an attendance record. Although there's, co there's cookies at the end, maybe not enough for everybody. You might have to run quickly, Poppy. <laughs> <laughs> Bobby's practicing her French, which is <laughs> which is funny because we're in Germany, but uh, we've been practicing our German too. Oh, this bit looks lovely. 
a little rise up into the forest loop. So it is a mixed terrain course, tarmac, forest path. I think they said a, a little river at some point. Not in the river, next to the river. <laughs> We're just enjoying this forest loop here. It really is, really just gorgeous. There's sun coming through the trees and Poppy's trying to keep up with Eva. <laughs> um, it's going well so far, actually. The forest loop has been longer than I thought it would be, which is gorgeous my ideal place to run. That or next to the sea maybe, maybe they're equal. We're just about to come out of the forest loop now. Oh, minding the doggy. And uh, then we head into the park. Oh wow, I think this is the front runner. Well done. <laughs> and, um, or one of the front runners. And then he's gonna jump on barcode scanning. So this is our barcode scanner. It's just gone past behind us. I really like bits like this. Poppy's just running on the grass. She's in her trail shoes, so that's lovely. And um, we've got the sort of start finish straight to our right, and in front of us, we run there as well. So it's one of those bits where you feel like park runners are everywhere. Oh my gosh, I'm dripping with sweat. It's so, so hot. Getting towards 30 today. Obviously nowhere near that yet, but it's, is hot and <laughs> there's our there height. Bobby's got a stitch. So thank you. Oh and sneezes. So we're just gonna walk this little bit. Um, we have had chocolate croissants, um, hot chocolate, orange juice, strawberries. <laughs> So not surprised, and I am boiling, so i um, happy with the walk. I cannot see, someone stole my sunglasses. <laughs> That's where we started, and uh, headed back down behind us. And this is where we're going to go, to do our little loop, a tiny loop here, and then back down, round the bottom, the woodland loop again, this little loop again and into the finish. Actually, it'll be really nice seeing people finish when we start this second little loop. Um, especially on a smaller park when you don't see people as much. I wonder if we will get lapped. I think we probably will. We're used to getting lapped on three lappers, but uh, two lappers, it depends. We did have quite a strong start there. Poppy's now massively overheating. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're still having a walk. It's just so, so, so very hot. <laughs> Front runner now coming through as we're turning left. Well done, great run. That's our barcode scanner. Um, and uh, the pressure's on when you're barcode scanning because nobody can get... Awesome buggy run, yeah, well done, Pops. Nobody can get scanned until he's finished. So you need to be first, really. Uh, <laughs> but he is. Closely followed by a very fast buggy though. Um, it's great to see those guys. I'm pleased we got lapped because we've only got one little straight and then they wouldn't lap us anymore. So just about to start our second lap. At this corner here, these guys are turning left, not into the finish. Oh yes, maybe they are. Are they doing this little lap into the finish? Yeah, they've done their little lap, so they are. They are turning left into the finish. <laughs> I'm confused. The gentleman on the corner who just turned up there, he's starting his little lap. Second round, thank you. So we're going straight here, second lap. That, anyone turning from behind us, heading up there into the finish. Oh, I am easily confused, aren't I, Poppy? <laughs> Poppy's coming up soon to her 200th park run. I think she needs to get to her 250th, really. 
because she's running in black and getting hot, I've been distracted because Poppy has just pointed out something which we definitely need to stop for. What have you found, Poppy? Alive turtles. No one's head does Look one at thing. these dudes. Right, I think we're saying goodbye to the turtles now, are we? No. No. <laughs> we, love, we love them too much. I have seen the tails, they're so cute, aren't they? How are we meant to leave? We're in a, a right predicament now. <laughs> I guess we can come off. We could always come afterwards, couldn't we? Should we go and get our run done? I wonder if when we come back, maybe one of them is going to have like its feet. It's <laughs> come on, let's go and we can well, think of... The brave one um, used to have its head on the path like to do that. <laughs> Towards the water, so I think maybe it'll, it'll maybe it'll be swimming. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Why you want to go in there with them and call that? Uh, um, no. We should think of names for them. What should we call the little turtle? I'm thinking of them. Okay. I'm we should report back. I just had a camera fail Ooh, through the trees to the lovely woodland path. Hey, did you get lost? Oh no, you're on your way back. Ah. Oh yes, you come out of the same place. <laughs> I thought you had got lost. She's finished her woodland loop. Anyway, camera. Um, yeah, total camera fail. We got so distracted and excited because there were turtles. <laughs> we saw turtles in the park. One of them was going to be Which, Jeffrey. Jeffrey. The brave one or the not brave one? Um, not brave. Not brave. Um, brave. so we're going to try and film them properly at the end. I did spend ages chatting to you about them and us enjoying them. But it wasn't filming. <laughs> we were too excited by the total camera fail. total camera fail. Um, it's total such fail. bright sunshine. I just have a little red light that tells me if I'm filming or not. Fail, fail, camera fail. I'm making excuses. Totally my fault, just to fail. <laughs> um, but we spent. They're so cute. Like we spent like ages enjoying them. So yeah, Poppy definitely. thinks they might be swimming when we go back. One but um, and now it's we're open. hoping that they will still be on the side. So we'd love to just go and see them again. We really, really struggle to carry on because uh, we don't see turtles every day at our park runs. On the second lap, this bit is so peaceful. There's nothing but our footfall and the sound of birds, and it's just gorgeous. This park run is really well signposted, so fork here, which one do we take? Oh, we take this one. Not many marshals. I think only one marshal between where you go up into the finish or start your second lap. And um, that's pretty much it, I think. Have there been any other marshals? I don't think so. I think just all well signposted. Um, which actually, feels more fitting in some way because it makes the forest really really peaceful. We just turn a corner here but we're running next to this lovely teeny tiny stream as we finish our woodland loop and head back to go up the start finish straight, start the tiny loop and then head into the finish. Poppy's so hot that we've made a deal we are walking in the sun running in the shade so the whole of this next bit is in the sun although start finish straight is in the sun and we normally can't help running when people cheer us so we see what happens there really we just want to finish and go and see the turtles which poppy have been named jeffrey and shelly jeffrey and shelly shelly is the one that was hiding in her shell a bit worried yeah, yeah. likes her shell and Jeffrey, and Jeffrey one, which I think wants to swim because oh. he, he, he had his front paws in the water and he's like pushing with his back leg like I so Jeffrey to... wants to swim and he was sunbathing wasn't he? Yes. With his neck up and, and uh, looked the happier off. turtle. <laughs> We're going along here but I've just come to say there is a gorgeous little garden here. Really really lovely. I love the stone arch and uh, Oh look, Joe has finished his first ever park run! A long way to go. How, a, a long time ago. <laughs> How was that, Joe? It was good, actually, yeah. And will you come back next week? Probably not, no, because oh. we will be in Berlin. You know. Oh yeah, okay, oh, well, we'll forgive you then. Yeah. We come back the week after? Might. 
No idea. <laughs> I want you to say yes on camera. <laughs> okay, sure will. Yay! <laughs> but now I've got it on camera, so you have to. <laughs> People coming into the finish over there. And uh, we'll be heading up there to start our tiny loop. <laughs> Not quite coming into the finish yet. Or we'd probably have a, a very big PB. Yay! See you in a minute! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Probably that was a cool bit, wasn't it? You see, you can't help but running on a bit like that. So much support. Real park run bars. <laughs> it's too exciting to walk through a bit like that. There's something in the pool there, I am sure. Oh, look, and there's a little duckling the far side. I don't know if it'll come out. And there's fish. And there's fish. Oh my gosh, how are we meant to finish? Is that a turtle? It is, it's looking at us. Yeah. That. Wow, look at all the fish. There's, big, there's some big ones, there's mini. And there's some like... And mini. a duckling in the background. Mini ones. I want the turtle to move. These guys just said, have you seen the terrapin? And we're like, yes, this park is too distracting. No, we're meant to run. More fish. They're tiny. Can't see any bubbles. turtles in there. Terrapins, I don't know, terrapin turtles. Tortoises don't Ooh. go in water, do they? I don't know. I know. It's like my llamas and alpacas from Monster Trail. I don't know. Right, this is our finish. So come on, Pops, let's get in. Then we can go and see them. You can walk and then I get to beat you. Bye, guys. I'll see you. Lovely to meet you, Marge. Bye. There we go. She's going to go. I know. I knew she was going to go. I knew it. I knew it. Zil. Well done, Poppy. Thank you so much, Token. Thank you. Well done, Pops. You always beat me. I knew you were going to go. I was waiting. Poppy's just getting scanned by Barnaby. Perfect. All done. Great stuff. And, and that, position. So I'm 36. 36. Do you know what the attendance record was before? No. <laughs> oh, is it 47? So I don't think we will have quite beat that today, will we? But close. I've scanned my barcode and Poppy is still over here. So um, I'm, I'm really hoping that means the terrapins are there. I'm going to go and see. Fingers crossed. They are still here. <laughs> we don't go onto the brakes because we don't want to scare them. Okay. I'll come around. Not step on these if you do really want to, then you can. Hello, Jeffrey and Shelley. I Jeffrey is still sunbathing. I know, but uh, as I told you, his hands are still in the water. Oh, yes, he has, guys. And what do they have? Then, are they paws? Claws? We don't know. What do, what do terrapins have? And is there a difference between a turtle and a terrapin? Hmm. Size? I don't know. So he's got his two front claw paws, wherever they are, in the water. In fact, Shelley also has her two front claw paws in the water. Shelley had a dream look. As you see, she's dripping. She is dripping. She did have a drink. Jeffrey's claw paws are definitely in the water. Jeffrey doesn't make a plan, he just does action. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. <laughs> a dragonfly. A terrapin turtle. <laughs> and are they more hens or ducklings? Run director Alison has made some lovely uh, banana and chocolate cookies, so I'm eating that whilst realising that we're not that good at naming wildlife. Um, <laughs> there's a, a lovely little bit here. I wonder if I can show you. See these stones have gone into sort of a pagoda -y bit, so um, I'm going to explore that too. Are we turtle hunting? Terrapin hunting? What are we doing, Pops? Just exploring, exploring somewhere new. <sighs> Poppy's found lots of fish where she is. This is a much better viewing point for the turtle. I think Poppy said this one's called Ripples because it's in the water, but it's staying very still. <laughs> Tails coming in now. Well done, guys. What position are you? 37. That's your best. Mm. Oh, brilliant. 
Bylander Park Run finished. The event being packed away. Time to head to the cafe, but um, we have to retrieve Poppy, which may be hard because she's with the ducklings and turtles. We finally got Poppy to come with us. Poppy's conducting some stinging nettle research. You see, I touched the top of stinging nettle, right? Did not sting. The bottom did not sting. And then the edges you touched did not sting. What about the stalk? Because when you grabbed it, you got stung, so it must be the stalk. But once I touched the sides, didn't it stung me? So I'm just really... I think it's to do with the pressure you touch it with. If you touch it super lightly or really hard, it doesn't sting but medium pressure stings. That's yeah, my theory, like, my hypothesis. When, when you walk against it. it, it brushes you so lightly. Yeah, so no, that's medium. No, 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 light. <laughs> anyway, let's get a coffee. I've just confused. We're in the cafe, we've got drinks and ice creams, and, and drinker, and shrimp shop, ich drinke ein shrimp shop. <laughs> I was concentrating too hard on the name. So this is the Pepsi version. Spezi is the cola version. Um, half cola, half Fanta. It is amazing. <coughs> Highly recommend trying this. You guys love it too though, don't you? You're laughing, but you like I, it. As a kid, I drank that. Yeah. <laughs> oh, as a kid. I've got, I've got the kids' drink. I've also got the kids' ice cream, actually. I've not tried this before. This Joe's is. description of this was chicken nuggets but ice cream <laughs> which like it obviously sold it well <laughs> I'll report back you went for it. <laughs> oh my gosh they're so cute what did, what did you just say can I have two can I have two please what's that on the table in front of you well I'm not going to you can have some you can have a bite we can big bite we can switch but they're just so tiny let's just do an uh, confect <laughs> Does that mean I can have Would you like one? Oh. Uh, yeah. Yeah, danke. <laughs> Bitte. We're just walking back to the car now. We've had drinks and ice creams. Oh, the weather is absolutely glorious. Huge thanks to Alison and the team at Drylander Garten Park Run in... Ooh, where are we? Where are we? Weil am Rhein. And uh, it's just been wonderful. It's been really lovely to get another park run in in Germany with our friends maybe they'll visit again I really hope that they do and it becomes their Saturday tradition one can but hope they'll watch this video and uh, hopefully they're like yes that's what I want to do they can go and visit Jeffrey and Shelley and Ripples <laughs> every Saturday morning <laughs> it's been wonderful though yeah it really really has huge thanks to you guys for watching uh, all the usual things give the video a like if you've enjoyed it subscribe for more running adventures tomorrow we fly to Copenhagen to run their extra day park run on Monday then up to Sweden to Gothenburg to run their extra day park run on Tuesday and then back to the UK whistle stop tour of park run world oh the only other thing to mention here is that uh, the cafe opens at 10 and there's toilets in the cafe but there were not toilets before park run so just something to be aware of um, yeah, I think that's it for today. So, ciao, tschüss, and I will see you soon.